Hey Keith, you asked me about um, how I get those measurements and what I use is I use uh, Google Earth. So you have to go to you know Google and download Google Earth and what it'll do is it'll download, it'll show you this page. <clears throat> All you gotta do is uh, put in your address. So let's use my address, 8912 Fawn Ridge Drive. Click Zoom and it'll take me to the house just kind of like Google Maps does. And the tool that we use is the measuring tool. So once I zoom in with my mouse to my roof, and for you, I assume you're going to be measuring square footage for the yard. So what you're going to do is you scroll up here, click the measuring tool. It's going to ask you a line, a path. If you do the line, you can just get the square footage from one point to the other. But if you create a path, and you can click here feet, kilometers, yards, whatever you want to do. So if we wanted to do yards, all we're going to do now is take our mouse, click it in the corner, click it in the other corner, and just kind of drag to each corner. And what it's getting is it's going to give us the whole all the yards. You can even go around my patio. So obviously if you're not doing pest control on the patio, you see how it's kind of giving me all the square footage right around my deck? And then you could take it, you know, whoops, right to here. I got a little, you got to work with it a little bit. It's a little bit, uh, when you get close to the other one, it wants to finish, finish off the square footage. So here you can see, you know, uh, 72 yards. And um, that's pretty cool. It'll give you, you know, a path. I think that'll... I think for you, you're gonna have to get square footage, so you're probably gonna have to go length times width, kind of like what I use on the roof. But that's what I use, you have to play with it for a while. There are some tutorials on YouTube that might, might help you out, but uh, that's basically it. You just punch in any address you have, as long as they, that address shows up on Google Maps, you can get it. And then you can also get the square footage if you clear it. You could get the uh, square footage in my front yard too. So if you took it from you know, here, to here and if we wanted to switch it to feet 26 32 and then if you wanted to get that number cleared out and then take from my front yard you know to the front of my driveway so length times width and you'd be able to get your square footage and obviously you can measure the, the front yard and sides whatever you had to do so that's what I use and it works really good so hopefully that was helpful see you bud